right, I'm Josie Williams. I'm a, the current Texas Medical Association president, but my home is in Paris, Texas. I work at the Health Science Center in Bryan College Station, and I'm a gastroenterologist by training, uh, but also work a lot in system design. 20% Medicare cuts in rural Texas is devastating. The primary care physician today has a huge disparity of their practice load, and in fact, uh, in Texas and rural areas and in the Valley, uh, as many as 80, 90 percent of their patients are care and Cade, Medicare and Medicaid, so that they have very little in the way of private insurance. And if you decrease the reimbursement of Medicare and Medicaid in a practice that is now making $1.60 for, for pediatric patients, uh, that's a lot of patients to make a living. And when those cuts go into effect, they literally can no longer afford to see it. I recently uh, talked with a physician who was, told me he was making $1.60 per Medicaid patient, uh, that, which is tied to the Medicare payment system. And what he said to me was, uh, I've been doing it because it's the right thing to do. I know that we as physicians need to do that. But if I have to go any further, I can no longer afford to keep my practice open.